Chimera is one of the most feared creatures in Greek mythology. The bestial being is a hybrid of the body and head of a lion, another head of a goat, yet another of a dragon, a serpent tail, and if all of those things were not enough, Chimera was a winged creature. The monster was a recurrent presence in the imagery of the Hellenic world in which it exerted its mythical role and, for that, occasionally its depictions would vary from one culture to the other. Sometimes it was depicted only with two heads or wingless, but the fear of the creature was something shared by all. Daughter of the monster Typhon and Echidna, the parents of the most tenebrous creatures of Greek mythology, Chimera was seen as a bad omen. The simplest fact of spotting or dreaming with a chimera meant that something bad was about to happen. The beast was the embodiment of terror. When it hit a region, few things remained after its passage. Fighting it was almost an impossible task because the creature, despite its size, was extremely agile. With its lion claws, it was capable of dilacerating its opposition. With its dragon head, it burned entire cities. And, even when it was surrounded, it would fly away, escaping the siege. However, its reign of terror did not last forever. Chimera was devastating the region of the Kingdom of Lycia when it was confronted by one of the major heroes of Greek mythology. Bellerophus was his name. He was a protege of the goddess Athena, and with the help of the glorious winged horse Pegasus, the hero was able to exterminate Chimera. The creature's popularity among the bards and poets turned it into something known worldwide. However, during the Middle Ages, it was gradually replaced by the figure of dragons. Lastly, Chimera can be seen as a representation of all the evilness created by man's perverse imagination, the monstrous dangerous that he carries within himself.